Lord Janner was due before a magistrate today, his first court appearance on 22 charges of sexually abusing boys at a children's home over a period of 20 years. TV crews and press photographers assembled, but the 87-year-old, who served as Greville Janner MP for 27 years, did not attend. Two psychiatrists testified that Lord Janner's dementia is now so severe that he would not be able to comprehend virtually anything said to him or about him that he has no recollection of an event within 10 to 15 minutes of it occurring and that it was highly likely he would become distressed in the alien environment of a courtroom. Distress that the prosecution said would be inappropriate and disproportionate to the proceedings. But Chief Magistrate Howard Riddle disagreed. I accept that if he were here, he could not contribute in any meaningful way, he told the court. Nevertheless, the law requires his presence. I understand, and this is very significant. It is likely to have no long-term effect on him. The judge then asked prosecutors to explore imaginative solutions, like holding the court in Lord Janner's home or a suitable building close to it. There's an important principle of open justice that somebody who's sent for trial appears in public so everybody can see them. And in this particular case, where there's been so much concern, you can see why the magistrate wants to play everything by the book and comply with the law, if at all possible. Once this case does reach the Crown Court, it's expected a trial of the facts will be held, which cannot deliver a verdict or a sentence. Lord Janner has always denied the allegations against him. Catherine Jones, 5 News.